type 3 a in nigus classification of hernia a direct inguinal hernia b indirect inguinal hernia c femoral hernia d umbilical hernia answer is a direct inguinal hernia in this video i am going to discuss about nigus classification of hernia there are four types are there type 1 2 3 and 4 so what is type 1 type 1 is an indirect inguinal hernia basically it is an indirect inguinal hernia with internal ring with internal ring that is deep inguinal ring is normal deep inguinal ring is normal it's typically seen in cases of infants and pediatric age group as well as in the young adults type 2 type 2 is indirect inguinal hernia type 2 this is also indirect inguinal hernia but here the internal ring that is a deep inguinal ring is enlarged is enlarged but the hernia does not extend down into the scrotum this is type 2 next type 3 type 3 you got three types are there 3a is it is a direct inguinal hernia 3a is a direct inguinal hernia 3b is indirect inguinal hernia with encroach upon the posterior wall of the inguinal canal like sliding hernia scrotal hernia or pantaloon hernia so all these extensive types of indirect inguinal hernia you can see in type 3b type 3c is it is very simple it is femoral hernia ok that is about uh, type 3 groin hernias and uh, type 4 type 4 again type 4 also there are 4 uh, 4 types are there a b c d but type 4 as a whole it is a it is a recurrent hernia it is a recurrent hernia whereas that uh, a type a is direct recurrent direct hernia recurrent direct hernia type b is recurrent indirect hernia type 3 is 3 c is sorry type 4 c is femoral hernia and last type 4 d is combined okay so this is the basic classification migus classification of groin hernia